Hey there, this is Steve, and this is another Excel tutorial. In this one, we're going to talk about how to unhide columns in Excel. This is something that people get hung up on, and if you can't get them unhid, then you have columns that are missing, and that can be super frustrating, and I totally get it. So let me show you how, and a couple of tips and tricks with that. So let's dive into an example here. And this is just a little spreadsheet that I made up for a compound interest calculator video, but it'll work just great. And you can check out that video. I'll try and put a link at the end of the video. But let's say that we are sitting here and looking at this spreadsheet and someone has hidden these columns. And the way you do that is you select them and click hide. And so here we are looking at our spreadsheet and something is wrong. It doesn't look like we have all the right information. The most straightforward way to figure out if you're missing columns is to just look at the column headers because obviously this goes from A to D and then follows the alphabet logically but where you have this gap you obviously have some columns missing. Another way to tell though is to look at the space between the columns and so this one is a single line and when I hover over it it gives me a single line with arrows on the side. This one is a double line, and when I hover over it, it gives me a double line with arrows over it. So, how do you get the columns back? Well, there are a couple of ways. The easiest way is when you see the double lines here, you just double click, and poof, column C comes back. If you want to bring column B back, you double click again. Let me get it right. There we go, and there's column B. Okay, and now you can see there are no double lines left and we have all of our columns. So that's trick number one. Let's go ahead and hide these again. And we'll look at another way to bring them back. And that is by right clicking and clicking unhide. So if I highlight over these two where the gap is and I right click, there is hide and there is unhide. So if I click on unhide, all of them come back which is really nice. Okay, one more thing I want to show you because this is another place where people can get hung up quite a bit. You've hidden these. If I click, say here, and I right click and I go to unhide, nothing's going to happen because I'm not selected in the right spot. What's more, if I click here, which is right next to the hidden cells or, or columns, and I right click and go unhide, nothing's going to happen. Click here, unhide, nothing's going to happen. The point of that is you can be clicked anywhere around here or in your spreadsheet and click unhide and it's not going to work. You have to be selected on the two columns that surround the hidden columns. Then when you click unhide, you're good to go. Okay, so that's how you hide and unhide columns in Excel. Hopefully that helps you out of a bind. If it does, please click like, subscribe to the channel, or check out one of my full courses in the description below. I would love to teach you more about Excel so you can be an Excel master. And if you want to learn about compound interest, you can click on the video here. Hopefully it'll be coming up for you correctly, and you can go check that out because that's actually a really cool thing to learn. Thanks, and have an awesome day.